Enjoy your meeting. And what an awesome day to be making some... Just a reminder, today's meeting is being recorded. Hi, this is Angela Lehman of Living Well Now Leadership. I'm grateful to all of you who are listening in live and also mindful that some of you are catching this as a recording. This is a Wednesday Wisdom Call from December 2nd, 2015. I was just saying that it's awesome to, even on this very second day of December, be looking ahead to January. We know in this business that it isn't so much what we do tomorrow um, or today as it is how we envision our commitment and our dedication and our discipline over the course of a, a period of time, however long you decide that is. Um, I'm joined tonight by three amazing leaders from our Living Well Now team. Deborah Lehman is our platinum leader um, from here in Peoria, Arizona, also happens to be my loving mother. I'm also joined on the call tonight uh, by Andrea Lehman, who is my sister-in-law, but also um, in, a diamond with Young Living here in Peoria, oh, actually in Surprise, Arizona. And also Shauna Allred, who is a gold leader with Young Living, um, who doesn't happen to be related to me, but uh, Shauna, you're like a sister. So, so what? Aw, thanks. <laughs> we'll claim you. <laughs> we, yeah, we'll, we'll adopt you in. We are grateful um, to all three of you for uh, setting up this call tonight, giving our leaders kind of a state of um, living well now at the end of this, of this calendar year. You all have come back from GoPro, um, which is an event run by Eric Worry, network marketing professional Eric Worry. Um, and that was in Vegas back in October, and it really sparked some great uh, movement on our team in terms of um, not just the system that we've developed over the last few years, but also the long-range planning that we have for Living Well Now. So we are so excited about the teaching and training that you received live from that GoPro event. We know many of our team is getting ready to, uh, and maybe already has, uh, purchase their tickets for next year's, or at least claim their intent to attend next year's GoPro event in December 2016, so a year from right now. And uh, we are, um, we know that Eric Worry brings some amazing, uh, amazing skill development and leadership to the network marketing professional. And many of us have read or listened to his book entitled GoPro or have seen his DVD, Rise of the Entrepreneur. And we know this is a timely um, experience to be a part of network marketing. We know that Young Living has an amazing product that we love dearly and that has uh, proven to help all of us reach wellness, purpose, and abundance. So we're glad to see those two schools of thought come together um, for the Living Well Now team. So, Andrea, I want to turn it over to you first. We didn't really talk about who was going first, second, or third, but if you could just give a quick um, introduction to Eric Worre's talk that inspired these three pieces that we're going to discuss tonight, and then um, go ahead and, and share your, your part. That would be awesome. Sure. Okay, so when we went to GoPro, you know, all of us that went, I don't remember exactly how many of us uh, ended up going this year, but there was a good chunk of us. A lot of us came together after GoPro and met up to, to talk about what were one or two things that we wanted to take away with us to implement in the Living Well Now team going forward. And I, I think what I would say about Living Well Now team is that we always want to get better. That's always our goal is what can we change, what can we do better, what can we offer better um, for our group as we continue to grow. And so consensus from, from those of us that met after GoPro was um, one particular talk that Eric Worre gave at GoPro. He talked about three things that you should be tracking in your business. And for those of you who aren't very familiar with Eric Worre, he's definitely somebody that you want to be watching, somebody that you want uh, to be paying attention to. You know, being in the, in the network marketing profession for over 30 years, um, growing huge organizations, having, you know, written books that we love, you know, on the topic, GoPro. Mm -hmm. And um, he's definitely somebody that you, you just want to listen to and, and take notes and pay attention to. So when he gave us three things to track, I think that that stood out to all of us as something that we want to be intentional about doing ourselves in 2016, as well as making sure that all of those on our team who are wanting to take this business seriously and grow a substantial business, making sure that they're also tracking these things. So I'm going to take the first one, and then um, we'll go to De Deb, and she'll talk about the second piece to track, and then Shauna will finish up tonight with the third thing to track. 
So if you don't have a uh, pen or pencil out and paper, I'd suggest that you get one now so you can jot these things down and have them for yourself and for your team. And so I'm going to start with tracking your appointments, so your monthly appointments. And um, he said that it's, it's very important to do that because your appointments are really your income-producing activity. When you think about what are the things that we really need to focus on in business, I've heard it said that we need to spend 80% of our time prospecting, 19% of our time helping new people get started, and 1% of the time managing issues and problems. So if the vast majority of our time is supposed to be on income-producing activities, things like, you know, um, prospecting, inviting, sharing, following up with people, then looking at how many appointments you're putting on your calendar monthly really is very important. And I remember um, three years ago after getting back from convention, uh, one of the things that stood out to me was Melissa Pepping saying she made sure from the beginning of her business that she did at least six events every month. And so, you know, the whole find somebody who has what you want and do what they do at that time, she was somebody that I was looking up to uh, in this business and said, okay, I'm going to do the same thing. So from day one, I made sure that I had at least six events on my calendar, personal events on my calendar. So these can be things like, you know, your own class you're hosting, you know, you ask a friend to host a class, um, LWN events, online events, um, meetups, one-on-one -on -one meetups, things like that. But six things that you can bring people to. Now I want to show you, if, if you have a piece of paper, write this down. Let's say that you start your business and in that first month you hold two events. And let's say that you bring somebody on board with you and so in month two you hold two events and that person you brought on board with you held two events. So now you've got two events for the first month and then you've got two plus two events for the second month. Okay, so let's say in the third month you hold two events and then the person that you brought on last month holds two events and then you bring on some, you've brought somebody else on and they hold two events and let's say another two events. So we're like, if you're following me, we're at two for the first month, we're at four for the second month, we're at eight for the third month and if you add all of those together, you're at a total of 14 events over three months. Now let's see what happens when you step that up and you're doing six events and that's what you're teaching. Six the first month and then 12 the next month and then 24 the following month. And you can see how it just continues to, to grow exponentially. So if we are modeling, filling our calendar with events and one-on-ones and we're teaching others to fill their calendars, it's going to be huge for our growth because two events versus six events it, at the end of the year is, is a huge, huge difference. I want to read to uh, you something really quickly out of Making the First Circle Work by Randy Gage. And it's called, uh, or chapter five, it's called Making It Rain. He says, busy work versus income producing activities. I'm on a crusade, a crusade to create the proper expectations on what it takes to do the business. I still hear people recruiting with a pitch that the business can be started in four or five hours a week. Not a chance. No one builds a network, uh, networking that kind of schedule. Sure, you can build a small retailer business with those hours, but you can't duplicate a large network. To do the business beginning on a part-time basis, you need to put in at least 10 to 15 hours a week. Because once you get a runner or two, they will need you to be available for events and calls, working with some long-distance lines and helping out on other things that can't be done in four or five hours a week. But that isn't the real issue. We can go to your company convention and ask for a show of hands of all the people who work at least 10 hours a week, and 90% of the people will have both hands in the air and are moving them like they just don't care. But here's the problem with that. Sorry, kids, but spending five hours chatting on Facebook and sending, and sending out some tweets is not really building a business. Uh, checking your back office every five minutes to see what your volume is and if anyone signed up, any new team members, is not building a business. Calling all your frontline people and affirming how fired up you are doesn't get it done. Organizing your stock of vitamin tablets and or we could say oils, oils in alphabetical order on your stock shelves doesn't make your bonus check go up. And he goes on and on about all of the things that we tend to get busy with that really aren't income producing. So in the new year, 
focus on what do you have on the calendar and keep track monthly. How many events, how many you know, one-on-one -on -one meetups did I have and track that. If you see that your business isn't growing as fast as you want it to, how many events did you have on? How many events did you know, your new builders have on? But really focus on more events. Adam Green says, more meetings means more money. So let's focus on that in the new year. Okay, I'm going to hand it over to you, Deb, to talk about the second thing to track in the new year. Thank you, Andrea. Thanks for inspiring us about six events per month and 10 to 15 hours per week. That's awesome. Another piece that we are so excited about um, that Living Well Now has worked hard on and even feels excited more for as coming into 2016 is the idea of promoting events. Promote is just has so much more vibrancy in it than the word invite. So we're promoting people to come to our events. And um, I'll just say starting with um, Ignite coming up. We are, our second annual Ignite is happening February 27, 2016. We had about 400 people attend our first event last March. And so far, in six days of us having some Black Friday specials, we already have 209 people who have committed to attending. So we are thrilled about that. Promoting is happening among our teams, and that is so thrilling. Our goal is to be able to fill the room at the Renaissance in Glendale with six to 800 people. So we are excited about that and have put that out there. Um, Angela's laughing because she is like, oh, that's scary. That feels a little scary in the stomach. And that's right. So we want you to promote um, with us that event. We are excited about Adam Green attending his new book out. Um, and we are thrilled uh, that he will be teaming up with Maura McDaniel on, um, as a presenter. And also we are thrilled, beyond thrilled, to have Artemis Limpert. And you have been seeing some information about her. Uh, on Facebook and also can go to our YouTube um, channel to watch her video from Wednesday Wisdom um, a couple of weeks ago. So we are thrilled about that. Also, our convention is huge. Um, Eric Worre said, getting your people to your annual international convention is absolutely key to building your business. And this past year in August, we had two different sessions with Young Living, and we had our team members, we had over 100 team members commit to coming to uh, the convention. And this year, people are already coming. I don't know what our numbers are at this point in time, but registration for that is $189 right now. Between now and January 31st, you can go to Young Living's website to get more details. But we are so excited about that opportunity um, to double our numbers there. What Eric says is that for every person you bring to your international convention will increase your income by one to $2,000 per year. So let me repeat that. Every person you bring to the international convention will increase your income one to two thousand dollars per year, so that is significant. Um, and then we go to GoPro, and GoPro is an example of where you go for skill-specific business opportunities. And when we went in October, we had 22 members that went to Las Vegas to that event, and we also had opportunity for people to live stream that event in addition to those 22 people. So we were thrilled about that. We came back pumped about um, selling tickets right out the get-go, and we have 100 people um, committed already, and that event is next year this time, December 1st to the 4th. And we already have 100 people, and we would love to have another 100 or more. And the investment in that is $300 um, per person, and that is awesome. And so what Eric says in addition to that 
is for every person you bring to an event like GoPro, you will increase your income by $5,000 per year. So every person you bring to a skill-specific event like GoPro will increase your income $5,000 per year. So you can see that promoting events, big events like this, in addition to the, the um, duplicating ones, the intro classes, the now what classes, the continued ed classes, that's where it begins. And then committing to investing in the bigger events for yourself and encouraging your team members is absolutely key and crucial. So investing in training and experiences are so important. And I will say that we also encourage people as people begin to make um, commission in, in income from their businesses to take a percentage of that, 10% of that, and you're off, first you're paying for your product, but then you are also investing back into yourself. So taking 10% of that income you are making from your Young Living business and putting it toward these bigger events are absolutely um, mind-blowing, exciting for the income-producing um, opportunities that they provide for you. So I can't say enough about, as we are so excited about Unrolling 2016, to get your tickets to Ignite in February, get your tickets to convention in June, the June date, um, go for that are um, the 22nd through the 26th of June is convention, and then GoPro is next December 1st through 4th. So thank you so much tonight for being on this call with us, being excited with us as we continue to promote ourselves and events and invest in ourselves. You'll also see that uh, from time to time we will highlight, actually every month we highlight Danny Johnson's uh, training schedule because we think your personal development is really important as well. Those three events that we just talked about would be more professional development, but your personal development is key. And so we usually have a large number of Living Well Now members that attend Danny John's First Steps to Success um, and the Creating a Dynasty every year. And so those happen about every six weeks. And you can stay in touch with us um, on Facebook and with your sponsor and enroller to get that specific information as well because this really is a journey of personal and professional development as you grow further and helping um, inspire and take along um, your team will make a huge difference in your business overall. So I would just also add that piece in as well. Shauna, um, will you help us uh, understand the third point of what Eric Worre was telling us uh, at GoPro as well? Absolutely. So I am so super jazzed to be able to share with you um, the third step that he was talking about for uh, tracking in your business, and that is to track the number of senior stars or second level rank, which for Young Living is senior stars, that are happening in your organization every month. And that is referred to, um, or he is referring to new senior stars. So not just the people that are holding senior star month by month by month by month, but the number of new senior stars that are ranking as a new senior star each month. And that may, if you are a brand new business builder, that may be that that's your first goal is to hit senior star and then help others hit senior star. And he gave us the little warning that if that number in your organization starts to decline, so for example, in uh, let's say November, I have two new senior stars in my organization. And then in December, I have three new senior stars. And then in January, I go back down to two. He said that should be the red flag that your business is in trouble. And you should get going with some better steps to help your people be equipped as they're coming through the door as new distributors. So when we heard about this big, big focus on senior star, and I'll also point out that as Ange Lehman went to um, Mastermind, they were saying the same thing. Randy Gage at Mastermind was saying the same thing, to focus on this second level growth and to track that number in particular. And that as you're tracking that, your business will grow. There is a quote that I love by Julian Hall, and it says, the secret to growth is helping others grow. And in this business, that is exactly, exactly, exactly the layout. 
It is a business of helping others, and I love that. So what we have found is um, that we already had started something similar to tracking that senior star, and what we were calling it, and we were doing it as an event month by month, was called Senior Star Sprint. And it comes with a cash prize at the end for as a new distributor who earned the most points during that month in participating in different growth development um, type things, as well as reading the script for the first time at a class and all those great things. And this was a super fun event that we started back in the spring of this year. And we decided that this was the perfect opportunity to pair the current Senior Star Sprint event with what Eric Worre and Randy Gage and actually also other uh, million dollar earners even with Young Living use a similar system and pair this together with tracking senior stars and develop an actual system, a daily stepping system that is not only fun, but also is a very friendly, encouraging way for our new distributors that are up and coming and growing their business to learn the basics of uh, our Young Living organization and building a business. So I first want to also give a shout out to our incredible Living Well Now team that has been uh, developed by Deb Lehman and Andrea and Ange in particular, and the amazing resources that they have put out for us, such as the script, which has been beautifully designed. I mean, I know some people go, I don't, I don't know if I want to read a script, but it has been beautifully designed for success and beautifully written and crafted with all different personality types in mind, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. But we have class handouts. We have following up papers that we are equipped with and helping people sign up for essential rewards and all these wonderful, wonderful resources that the Living Well Now team has developed for us and has given to us on their website. We also have amazing third-party tools, such as all these books and resources and audios and we have websites. We've made personal connections with other people in the Young Living business as well as in network marketing. And what we were finding is that it was starting to get a little overwhelming for all of the brand new distributors coming in. When they come in, there is so much information, but we needed to bring it way back down to the basics. So the goals that are above on your Living Well Now team have masterminds grouped together and come up with a beautiful laid out system for success in the way of this Senior Star Sprint. It is basically a 28-day system, and it will go month by month, so it will begin each month. And it will be a step-by-step -step introduction to building your business from the level of distributor all the way up till you hit the rank of Senior Star. Now, each person that is a participant in this Senior Star Sprint so a participant would be a new distributor up until you hit the rank of senior star, will um, only pay a $5 fee. And that's just kind of a buy-in because we have found that when you get a little bit in there uh, monetarily, you're, apt, you're, you're more apt to following through with the steps of what, it's, what the event is all about and what the group is all about. And the beautiful part of it, this too is as a participant, you have the opportunity to win a cash prize of $100 at the end of the month, and that's for the first place, and second place is $50 cash prize. So that little $5 also goes into the pool of that prize at the end for participating. So that's really, really exciting. So not only are we just giving you the steps to success, but we are rewarding you in addition to, of course, getting a, big, a bigger and better check from Young Living, we are also, as your team members, rewarding you for participating and really doing the steps that it takes to build your business from the get-go. So as a new distributor, this is really, really exciting to be able to go on to a secret group on Facebook that will be laid out for you by your Gold and Above leader. So if you don't know who your Gold and Above leader is, make sure you talk to your sponsor, ASAP, find out who that is, and find out how to get connected. And it will start on day one of each month and go through at the end of the month every day with a new thing to learn. Everything from introducing you to your virtual office to uh, where to find the resources of things like your script, et cetera. Also, just refreshing or maybe learning for the first time what the letters OGV and ER and those kinds of things stand for. 
when newbies come in, this is a foreign language, and we want to make sure that we're keeping it simple and we're keeping it basic, and everybody's getting what they need from the get-go. So this Senior Star Sprint is going to be huge for your business growth, and not only as a new person coming in up till Senior Star, but also once you hit Senior Star. So I'm just going to talk for a second on why the leaders, for, so this would be anybody from senior star to executive to silver and above, will absolutely want to stay engaged and um, very involved in the senior star sprint every single month. Now, you won't be a participant because you've already hit senior star, but this is the key, again, that quote that I said a little while ago, the secret to growth is helping others grow. This is the key to helping others grow in their business so that you can grow in your business. And I will just say, I think um, one of the best parts of this job is when somebody achieves a goal. I absolutely love when somebody else achieves a goal. In fact, I think I, I know, I know I get more excited and more giddy and more thrilled to help those other people achieve their goal than I have been with my own goal. It's really quite silly. But that's the blessing of this network marketing um, business. So as a leader, when we watch these senior stars come up uh, to the senior star level, it helps this new senior star sprint will help us track not only who is invested in wanting to do this, but how they're doing and if they're hitting those senior star ranks, et cetera. And as months go by, we can watch how many were invested in that senior star sprint, how many hit that rank, how is our business doing, and how is our business growing. Um, I love that. Um, I think it was Ann said at the beginning, the very beginning of the phone call, that we always are looking for ways to improve and to do things better. And one of my favorite things to say is we learn as we grow. And this is truly, our, our Living Well Now team has grown so much that this is a really great way to get back into a simplified system for those newer people in the business, but also for the leaders to start following and tracking those newer people in the business as well. So um, I'm excited because the senior star level is really a good marking point for knowing that a person has made an investment with Young Living more so than just wanting to use the products. This is a really key distinction between the level of star versus senior star, and that's a big part of the focus why Eric Worre, Randy Gage, all these people are saying to track that senior star number. So leaders, you are absolutely want to get it, want going to want to be 100% invested every single month on the Senior Star Sprint and knowing how those new, invested, committed business builders are doing, what questions they have, how you can support them, things like that. The leaders will have a little bit more of a buy-in. You guys are going to be, I think, $10 buy-in for that to also support the cash prize at the end of the month and uh, to make sure that your your team is getting what they need and support and encouragement as they go along. So let's see. The momentum, oh, I just wanted to, re I was looking at my notes, sorry about that. I wanted to remind the leaders also that once we kind of hit some of these ranks of senior star and executive and silver, we sometimes, at least I'll speak for myself, forget about what it felt like to be brand, brand new in the Young Living business. And I remember just starting to hear about oils and just starting to share about oils and the butterflies in my stomach that would happen uh, when I would tell somebody else about it and they were excited to hear about it from me. And, oh, my gosh, oh, my gosh, somebody else wants to do this. Somebody else wants to learn more about oils. Just that momentum and the excitement that um, comes with being brand new. That momentum is where we want to stay focused all the time in keeping that energy going, um, the synergy going, as Deb Lehman loves to say, and just really monitoring and encouraging those brand new distributors, keeping them going up to that first point of hitting senior star where they get to see that check come in the mail that pays for their oils or that check, com that, check that comes in the mail that maybe pays for a car payment or whatever they're looking for from Young Living as a business or even just that check coming in the mail might be the secondary part of them helping somebody feel better that month and have less things to complain about. <laughs> we'll put it that way to be compliant. So anyway, it's really, really exciting 
to see the leaders that are investing into this. So I want to remind you that the golden above leaders will be the ones that will be doing and leading the Senior Star Sprint for your team. So be sure to get connected with your golden above leaders. They are invested. They are excited. They are thrilled to be doing this system with you guys to help everybody just really start fresh from the beginning, get, getting your new people right up to Senior Star equipped with what they need to know, and then when that person hits senior star, turning right back around, and that person, that new senior star, helping the next person go right from the beginning up to senior star, and so on, and so on, and so on. It's a beautiful system. It works perfectly with the way that the Young Living Compensation Plan is laid out, and I'm excited that this is um, going to launch January 1st, so be ready to join into those first senior star sprints and get your new people and your leaders actively, actively involved so that we're all on the same page. Um, each day there will be a new post, and all of us across the Living Well Now team will be doing the same post on the same day. So you will all get the same information because we want to make sure that all of our new people are getting the right information at the right time and that we're not missing out on anything that could be important. So we've gone through all the different tools, resources, all of that good stuff, and put that 30-day program, really 28 days, um, so that we can finish it up each month into a beautifully laid out system for success. So we are excited to launch that, and uh, we'll probably launch it a week before January or so, so that you can start to sign in and get your new distributors ready to go with that. I think that about covers it for the Senior Star Sprint. Thank you so much, Shauna, for um, just inspiring us and energizing us for what's to come in 2016. We think this will be a great cultural shift for Living Well Now to, um, to support one another and, and to get people started on the right foot. Um, those people who say, how do I do this business and feel overwhelmed at the beginning with all of, all of the choices for tools and resources is just going to really streamline the program. And most importantly, go after those three tracking uh, pieces that Eric Worre shared about at GoPro. Um, how many appointments are on your calendar every month? Are you promoting events and taking people with you um, from your team? And how are you um, noting and tracking how many people are ranking up to senior star on your team every month? Those are awesome, awesome pieces, and we want to be part of a, a great network marketing company and team, um, and, and we know that these three parts will um, really energize our businesses and bring us success in 2016. Thank you so much for everyone calling in tonight and uh, listening live. Um, if you are local, we have an introductory class coming up on Saturday morning. If you're looking for a sixth or a seventh class to fill your calendar in, Mar in, De in December, um, that will be at Rio Vista at 10 a.m. And then there are two opportunities this month to join online calls next Thursday night, December 10th. Um, we'll have a Live in the Dream class. So if you do have new business builders that want to get started and, and get ramped up in December, they can join in at the same number that you called tonight, December 10th, or the 17th. We'll be having a conference call um, over the introduction to Everyday Oils, and uh, we would just invite you to uh, check out those events on the Living Well Now page. And remember, we have an awesome promotion this month in December for Young Living, so please uh, be reminding your folks to update their essential rewards order as the month progresses. Andrea, anything else for the good of the order to leave the group with tonight? Deborah, anything think, for the good of the order? Just so excited for our team continuing to learn and grow and um, the positivity and the willingness to learn from each other and be, being coachable. Those are just words that come up out of my mouth right off the bat that I just feel blessed for Living Well Now. Uh, caliber of people that we continue to have join us. So thank you so much for uh, being a part of a growing team. And Shauna? Um, yeah, just a thanks and a, a day filled with gratitude. I absolutely love uh, that the Living Well Now team has equipped us, and I feel convicted every day that the only way that I can fail is to quit because you guys have done such a phenomenal job of setting us up for whatever dreams we may have and investing in us to be able to achieve those dreams. So uh, def definitely a day of gratitude for me. Thank you so much, Living Well Now team, and um, for, of course, my team also for just 
just everything that you all do. So thank you. That's awesome. And we're going to keep that spirit rolling um, tomorrow night at the awards gala and also next in February at the Ignite event. Um, we're just really thrilled when any time we can all be together as a team. So blessings to everyone. Have an awesome night. And uh, we'll be in touch about the next Wednesday Wisdom Call uh, on Facebook. Thanks.